All right, if the first one wasn't ridiculous enough, I used it. I should have videotaped it. It didn't last long. It ended up folding up under the fucking four-wheeler, and I drove on top of it, and it was a debacle. It was just funny. But anyways, this is the 2.0 plow, and actually it works better. Um, if you look at this, you might know what it is. That's right. It's the door or a drawer out of an oven. And all I did, I took, I had that old fucking mower over there. I just uh, took the handle, bolted her on to the front rack there. There's a couple bolt holes. Just bolted her on. Literally, all I used is a little steel wire to keep it together. There, 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 and there. Drilled a couple holes. The first one's ripped out. And when that happened, it kind of folded up, so I had to put a couple tech screws to hold it back together, but it seems to be fine now. I got the two blocks in there for weight. Uh, they're not quite enough. I got an anvil over here. I might use that. But yeah, it's kind of silly, but it works. It's better than shoveling. Unfortunately, in the big blizzard, I was using it, and then my four-wheeler started fucking up and leaking gas. So, barely running, so I gotta take my carb off. So, that's gonna be a whole other job, and maybe another video. But, uh, just wanted to show you the 2.0 plow. I really gotta get some kind of a, a wheel, a pulley or something for up here for that to be able to slip better because. It really doesn't, the cable doesn't like winding up like that. It's really hard on the winch. Not that it's a good winch or anything. It's only 1,500 pounds. But anyways, like I said, this is the 2.0. We'll see how long it lasts. Hopefully by the next snowstorm I'll have it going again and maybe I'll get a little video of it in action.